Okay, for this question, they are asking the kinetic energy that occur in these stream units. So, the question given to you is, um, you have uh, this BFD. I draw the BFD first. So, where is the information um, given? Uh, the diameter of the pipe. Okay, that get into this unit. The diameter of the pipe is 2 cm. And then, it gives you the volumetric flow rate. Okay, the volumetric flow rate uh, is 2 meter cube per hour. So, this is information. The question asking you, what is the kinetic energy at this part? Okay. So, we know the equation for kinetic energy is half mass flow rate times with the velocity to the power of 2. So, we don't have the value of uh, velocity yet. So, how we want to determine that? We're using the volumetric flow rate. So, we know that the velocity it can be determined using the formula of volumetric flow rate divided by area. Okay. How you can determine area? You can determine area by using the diameter of the pipe. So, this is area of the pipe entering this unit. So, we want to get the kinetic energy for this pipe. So, we calculate the uh, kinetic, uh, no, velocity first, which is, we know the volumetric flow rate is 2 meter cube per hour. Okay. And then, we divide by area of the pipe, which is, you know, the formula for area is pi r square r is 1 so 1 to the power of 2 then we get cm here okay so we finish the formula to get the velocity but we have to convert it into meter per second so we know that 1 cm square is equal to 1 to the power of 2 uh, cm square sorry this is meter okay and then we have to convert the hour into second. Okay, one hour is equal to 3,600 second. And finally, you will get the velocity is 1.77 meter per second. Okay, now we have get the velocity. Uh, we uh, have to calculate the mass flow rate. So, uh, how to calculate the mass flow rate? Again, we can calculate the mass flow rate using the density of water. We know that the, the material that get into this unit is water. So, as we learned before this, density is equal to M or mass over V. Okay, so in order to get M means we have to multiply volumetric flow rate with the density. So, this is how we do it. Mass flow rate is uh, 2 meter cube per hour, which is volumetric flow rate. And then we multiply with the density of water, which is 1000 kg per meter cube. Then we have to convert one hour to second. Okay, hour to second. So finally, you will get mass flow rate is equal to uh, 0 0.556 kg per second for your mass flow rate. Now, finally, we can determine the kinetic energy. Okay, um, so bring back the formula of the kinetic energy. We know that formula of kinetic energy is uh, equal to half mass flow rate times uh, by velocity to power of 2. So, we know here half, then we have calculate 0 0.556 kg per second, okay, for the mass flow rate times with the velocity that we determined earlier, 1.77 uh, squared, so meter squared, second also squared, and then finish but still we have to convert into uh, newton 
per kg per meter second. So that the final answer of the unit will be in joule per second. So one newton is, you can refer this to the conversion table, okay? One kg um, times with meter per second square. So final answer for kinetic energy, you will get it around 0 0.870 uh, newton meter Per second or is also same as joule per second. Remember energy usually will be in joule per second or in kilowatt.